Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another video guys. Now, it's another sit down video, um, but it's a bit of an interesting one. Now, um, I just want to say a massive thank you, okay? Because yesterday, Sunday, I hit 6,000 subscribers. It feels good, okay? And... Honestly, it feels like it's starting to pay off. Um, and yeah, I just want to say thank you to everyone that subscribes to the channel because we are getting there, okay? The goal is 10,000 subscribers, which was... I never thought that would be achievable when I first started this, but it is so, it's starting to feel like I can actually hit that. But yeah, anyway, thank you for 6,000 subscribers. Let's get into the video. Right then, guys, in today's video... I'm doing. I'm jumping on a bit of a trend. Okay, now I, I've been. I've been seeing on. I've been seeing on YouTube people reacting to Premier League kits, reacting to Championship kits, reacting to League One and Two kits as well. And I've been sat here today in my chair thinking, what can I upload? Um, obviously, I do my match day vlogs, but I was just thinking today, what can I actually upload? And something came into my mind. All right, so I've got a thing called Tear Maker. Okay, and in this video, I am going to be ranking all of the Ipswich Town kits, the home kits, from 2009 up until 2019, which is this season. Okay, so I've got all the home kits up from 2009 to 2019, and we're just going to rank them. We're going to rank the kits, um, and we're just going to talk about each kit. Um, hopefully you enjoy this video. If you do, smack a big like, okay? Smash a big thumbs up on the video, because that would mean a lot. And then, obviously, if you could subscribe to the channel if you're new, that would be absolutely excellent, okay? Righty-ho then. So, so, the first kit I've got is this kit, which is, I believe that's the 2009 to 2010 kit, okay? Now, Personally, it's okay, you know, we've got white squiggles down the side. Um, it's, mm, personally, I wouldn't buy it, okay, with most town kits I would, I'd always buy, but with that, to be honest, I'd probably put that in, not a fan, because I'm not a big fan of that kit. Um, I'm, I'm just not a fan of the white squiggles, I just... Yeah, I'd put that in not a fan. Moving on then, so, the next kit is this one, which has got, you know, the very vague white stripes down the shirt. Uh, I think this is the 2010 to 11 kit. Um, I quite like it, it's okay. Uh, they, I've just answered the question, haven't I? Um, I'd put that in, it's okay. <laughs> um, yes, it's got like white bits here, but, you know, it's not too bad, it's got stripes. It looks like it, kind of like a retro shirt, but um, yeah, it's not the worst kit I've seen. So I put that in, it's okay because it's not actually that bad. Okay, moving on then. Um, I couldn't really see the kit, but it's this one. Uh, I think that's the 2010 to 11 or 2011 to 12, I can't remember. Um, but you know, it's got a bit of red on, red stripes. A lot of blue, which I like. Um, if that was still available to buy, I'd probably buy it because I personally I quite like it. Okay, because there's a lot of blue, not a lot of white. Um, so I put that in. I like it because personally, I think that's quite a nice kit. You know, it's got the Marcus Evans sponsor on the front, who our owner is. Um, obviously, that's changed now, but you know, I did like the Marcus Evans sponsor. I thought that. I thought that went well on our kits, but yeah, that, I put that in like it. Moving on then, this next one was, I think that's the 2013 kit. Um, it's, all, it's okay, it's okay. Um, you know, white sleeves, blue front, blue back. Obviously we've got the Mitre sponsor as well. Um, personally, it's, uh, I don't know, I really don't know, I'm unsure with this one because I'm not a fan of white sleeves, however with some kits, 
it look, the, the white seeds look okay. Um, I'll probably put, I'll, I'll put that in, it's okay, because, you know, it, it's not a bad kit. Um, so I'll put that in, it's okay. Okay, moving on then, moving on. Alright, the next kit is this kit, okay, now, this was the kit we had when we got into the playoffs. Honestly, guys, it's going in, love it, okay, I absolutely love this kit. Um, I did have it on my wall back there, but it's actually my brother's kit. I really like it, you know, it's it's a tight, it's more of a tight fitting kit, kind of like a V-shaped neck, but not massively. It's all blue, there's not a lot of white on it at all, um, and it just looks really nice. It's a really nice kit, and it's personally one of my favourite kits we've ever had. So I'd, I'd put it in, love it, because it is a very nice kit. Moving on then. Okay, so this one uh, was the year we played Man United in the cup, okay, and you know, it's got a collar, it's got a white bit down here. I wasn't a fan of this kit, I'm not going to lie guys. Um, I do actually have the shirt, I'm not going to get it out because you can see it on the screen. Um, to me, it just looks like a school shirt, like... Why would you make a football kit that looks like a school kit? I know it's all blue, I know it's got a white collar. Guys, I I'm not a fan of this kit, so I'd put it in not a fan. I wouldn't say it's shh, because it doesn't look that, it doesn't look like a sh you know, it's blue, it looks okay. I just don't like the collar, I'm not a fan of it. Moving on, okay, we've got four kits left. This next one is a... Bit of a strange one, um, you know, we had, this reminds me of like an R, uh, it's, it's like, you know that army badge, like the, the V's, we sort of have this on our shirt, we've got light blue, different shades of blue on this kit, and I'd probably put that in, that's a very tough one to be honest. With this kit, I thought there was so much white on it. There's too much white on this kit. Um, so for that reason, I'd probably put it in... Oh, I don't know. It's a tough one. I'd probably put that in not a fan. Um, I'm just not a fan of it. You know, there's so much white on it. I like our kits being filled with blue because... We essentially, we, well, we do play in blue. I don't see why we need to have so much white on the kit. So, for me, I'm not a fan of that. Um, I'd put it in that one, yeah. Moving on then. Um, the next one is this one. I believe that was the 17 to 18 kit. I honestly really like this kit, guys. Um, I'd probably put it in, I'd probably put this one in like it. Because, like I've said already... Pretty much all blue. Yes, we've got a little white collar. or well, it's not a collar, but it's like a white around the neck bit. Um, obviously, we've got the Marcus Evans badge on the front. And yeah, I really like it. No, nah, it's, 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 it is a nice kit, though, to be fair. Like, um, it's just, it just, it, it just, it's just nice. Right, I'm going to move on now. I'm going to try and keep this as short as I can. Next kit was last season's kit when we got relegated. Oh. Get ready for all the Norwich fans in the comments going, Oh yes, you're in League One. Whee. I don't care. Alright, now we did get relegated last season and this was the kit we had. I honestly, it's right here, I've actually got this kit. Um, that's the kit we had last season, and, and guys, I really like it, okay, so I'm going to put it in, like it, because, yes, I really like it, I know it's got, you know, it's got white, white sleeves, but, I don't know, the start of the season, I thought, what on earth is that, what on earth is that, you know, the Magical Vegas badge just doesn't go well with it, it just sticks out too much, I don't know, 
a lot of people didn't like this kit, but to be honest, it really grew on me, this kit. I wore it week in, week out, and then I started to like it, and I thought, you know, it's not actually a bad kit. So, for that reason, I put it in, like it. Okay, last kit then. This is this season's kit. Um, <sighs> okay, so, what I really like about this season's kit is... They've blended the Magical Vegas badge in. Okay, now I've got the old shirt here. That doesn't, I don't think it went on the kit very well. This season they've like implemented the colour of the Magical Vegas badge into the shirt. So it sort of goes better now. Um, and guys, this is my favourite ever Ipswich Town kit. Now that's a bold statement that because... Uh, there's been a lot of home kits and I've, lo I've liked a lot of kits with release but this really stands out for me it's, there's a, so much blue on the kit, there's hardly any white um, and you know our sponsor actually looks good now on the, sh on the kit so for me I would put this in, absolutely love it because you know it just stands out for me, it's a very nice kit um, and yeah that's, that's pretty much it to be honest guys I think it's a very nice kit, and that will be the kit we win the league in. We're winning League One. We're going up, boys. Um, so yeah. Right then, that is it. Okay, that's it for this video. Um, a bit of a different one. I've never actually reacted to anything before. Um, never reacted to kits, etc., etc. But there you go, guys. That is it for this video. I have reacted to the Ipswich Town home kits. From 2009 to, two, to 2009, from 2009 to 2019, so 10 years of kits I've just ranked from shit to I absolutely love it, okay? And um, let me know in the comments if you agree with any of my thoughts. Let me know in the comments as well, guys, which kit you prefer from the, from the playoff season and this season, okay? So... I'll put them on the screen right now. Those are the two kits. Comment which kit you preferred. I'd love to know your thoughts. Now that's it for this video. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. If you want to see more ranking videos, comment some more ideas what I can rank. Maybe Ipswich Town players, maybe Ipswich legends, maybe League One stadiums, League One kits. I don't know. There's a lot of things I could do. Comment down below what you'd like to see. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. I know it's been a bit of a different one. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. We are now on the road to seven, I can't believe I'm saying this, 7,000 subscribers. Mad. Okay. Like this video. I've repeated myself so many times now. See you in the next one, guys. Like this video and subscribe right now to Alex Griffin. No.